Hey guys, uh, welcome to the first video of assembling this uh, 6J1 preamp tube kit. Uh, in this one, we're gonna I'm going to sort all the pieces and we're going to cover them. Uh, this is the parts list as from the manufacturer. Uh, so we're going to find out we have everything on here. Unfortunately, there I, there is no, a, no sorting on these. So I have I'm gonna have to go through and look each of the resistors up because I don't have I don't know the color codes. So we're gonna sort it out. Uh, this is the power supply that I ordered in for it. It's a 13.8 volt AC power supply, and it comes with the proper connector already on it, so I don't have to mess around. 13.5 volt AC outputs, but I think it's uh, peak 13.8 volts. But it's one amp. Already has a 2.5 by 5, so we're good to go there. Now we're going to need little pieces of wire and you know assorted crap to put this thing together. But uh, I'm going to sort the pieces out into a tub like this here, and then I'll show you what we have. All right, guys, I got everything sorted out here now. I labeled everything, so we're going to go over the parts list. Uh, first is one PCB board; it's right here. Second is a one two watt 2.2. Um, metal foam resistor it's right here six one in four thousand seven current diodes are right here and we have six four point seven K resistors um, the only thing I wish it this kit would have is I wish that they would have came marked um, I had to sit and look up the color code on each of them but here's our six four point seven K um, then we have two one K's which are right here Four seven forty seven ohm resistors, which are right here. We have two two point two Ks, two four hundred and seventy Ks, two one hundred Ks, two two hundred ohms, which are right here. We have nine fifty volt four hundred and seventy microfarad film caps, four fifty volt one microfarad monolithic ceramics right there d667 transistors are here um or the b667s are here i i have one here that's not marked of the four or the 647s i'm hoping that it is a 647 so we'll, we'll see when we get it put together um potentiometer and the cap for it two three millimeter blue leds which are right here um, I don't have anything small enough. I, I really don't want them to be blue, but I don't have anything small enough, so they're going to go in the kit. Um, one DC 0005 power connector, which is right here. That's a standard, um, I think it's 2.5 by 5.5. Two tube bases, which are here, the ceramic bases. Two 6J1 tubes. This is where we have the problem. So I have this one beautiful 6J1 tube here. Gorgeous little pentoid tube and then we got his little smashed brother so I don't want to bash the the seller of this but uh okay I, I just may um you know if you sell something and when the buyer receives it it is broken like this and they give you pictures of it just send them a damn replacement people send them a simple replacement don't try to sell them another kit and that's what happened I purchased another kit for a, a, a less amount of money about a third of what I paid for this original kit so I'm, I had to buy a whole another kit to get a replacement tube well that replacement tubes coming but I also bought myself another replacement tube for 99 cents see they should have just sent me the tube so we'll have another one of the one of these uh, two preamps that we're gonna blow through a main amplifier then this we're gonna build as a scar box amp um, two RCA bases we already got here or here, the RCA jacks. Um, I'm going to put them on this kit just because it's going into a cigar box. Uh, we have our standoffs, and we have the potentiometer cap. Um, I'm not going to use this knob. I, I just won't. It's ugly. Um, all in all, this kit is a good value. I think I gave $11 for it. Um, the power supply, which is here. Thirteen point five volts AC 
and it's a 2.1 millimeter that's what it is but it's going to put it out at one amp which is what this board this kit calls for um luckily when i bought my power supplies i bought two haha <laughs> so i guess i prepared for them somehow magically but we're going to put this sucker together in the next video um i'm just going to do a straight build with it uh we'll be able to test it mono and then we'll be able to pull the tube and put it in the other side and test the other side of the stereo circuit um not preferably how i want but i gotta wait on the tube to come we got everything else uh we have a few people who have been sending me messages and asking how this circuit sounds if it sounds good does it sound better than our 20 cent amplifier that we have, have modified and hooked up a volume control to in other video i'll put that the link to that here um if you're looking for a cheap way to get sound out whether that be for a music player or cigar box guitar or whatever uh, check out the these little this video like i said check out the video uh it's very simple to add a volume control to it you can add tone control to it and turn it into a cigar box guitar amp to where you control tone and everything but uh right now we're going to turn muddy waters back on and we're going to start poking components into this board